Welcome to Tavira and the Eastern Algarve. Tavira is located about 40 kilometers or 30 minutes from Faro Airport in the eastern half of southern Portugal, known as the Algarve region. It is also conveniently about the same distance to the Spanish border, allowing for easy access to Spanish cities. Tavira can be reached using the toll highway, the A22, or taking a bit longer using the old highway, the N125. Tavira can also be reached by train with the station located south of the river that runs through Tavira. Conveniently, the bus station is also located on the south side and only a 10 minute walk from the train station. Tavira has a quaint old town with its Praça da República or main square. There are some lovely historical sites to see, including the historical bandstand, which is believed to date to around 1890. Tavira Castle, while not completely intact, is astonishing when you realize it dates back to Moorish rule in the 11th century. The majority of its damage happened in the earthquake of 1755. While exploring the castle, cross the square to see the impressive church Igreja de Santa Maria do Castelo, or visit other nearby churches for the art and architecture, including murals created with the famous Portuguese blue tiles. And enjoy a leisurely riverside walk as you look to find a cafe or restaurant to refuel and people watch while you enjoy the sunshine. A unique way to enjoy both the fresh air and combine multiple activities is to stroll the Salinas or salt pans of Tavira. This walk travels through the Rio Formosa tidal area and the salt basins, a boutique but important industry of the manual capture of pure quality sea salt. The fresh seawater in the area also attracts numerous types of birds, many unique to this area. Storks, spoonbills, egrets, warblers, and European canaries can all be spotted here. Or maybe you're looking for a day of relaxation and beach. In that case, Tavira Island may be exactly what you're craving. A short ferry ride takes you to this quiet island with huge beaches and soft white sand. Other than seafood restaurants and other visitors, this tropical type island is yours for the day, or at least until the last ferry leaves. Another beach to try is Praia Fort de Barra, part of the Rio Formosa Natural Park, with three small piers in the area. Cabanas de Tavira is a newer small town just outside Tavira, named for the small fishermen's huts that store the fishermen's gear. Now it's a popular summer tourist area with waterfront shops, bars, and restaurants, and a growing number of apartment and housing complexes built to cater to the growing number of tourists and locals, first to recognize the property potential here. A great place for a day trip is the fishing village of Santa Luzia, which is known for their expert preparation of octopus. The coastline here has little known beaches with natural scenery the Rio Formosa Natural Preserve is known for. Take a ferry to Praia de Terra Estrita for a stunning stretch of sand. Then find the small train that takes you to the unusual Praia do Burid, famous for the giant anchors in the sand, memorializing the abandoned tuna fishing village. And no area in the Algarve is far from a golf course. Benamor Golf is the course for you in the Tavira area. Other sports include football at the municipal stadium, a municipal swimming pool complex with a capacity of 400, and a busy tennis club with tournaments for every age group. There's also a huge multi-sports facility for sports including basketball, volleyball, gymnastics, karate, ballet, hockey, and skating. As far as medical facilities, Tavira has their local health center, as well as a couple of medical clinics. For your children's education, there are several schools to choose from, 
including secondary schools such as EB1 Tavira School and George Augusta Korea Secondary School. As for shopping, there is the municipal market for fresh fruits and vegetables, as well as all the chain grocers, such as Lidl, Aldi, and Pingo Dos. A large Continente store is part of the Grand Plaza Shopping Center for all your shopping needs. If you're interested in sand dune beaches and less hustle and bustle, you may want to check out the Eastern Algarve. Tavira is a great base in the east with every amenity, but a bit more of a laid back setting. Rest assured, it is a year round destination with more people discovering the East. As an investment, you'd be ahead of the curve and living here has more of a taste of Portugal before the crowds. If a more European feel and laid back vibe is your taste, you definitely want to explore the possibilities of the Eastern Algarve or if being on the forefront of investment potential is important to you. Consider Tavira and Cabanas to determine if they're a promising and profitable area for you.